It will be a presentation of one of our new IEF members, Asa Cosmos, and it will be on Baku, the cultural bridge between East and West. And Asa Cosmos is also a candidate city for hosting IEC 2022. Please help me in welcoming on stage the CEO of Asa Cosmos, Dr. Rashad Nabiev. Thank you very much, Christian. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm greeting you on behalf of Azar Cosmos, satellite operator of Azerbaijan. And it's our real pleasure to propose the candidacy of Baku to host uh, 73rd International Astronautical Congress in 2022 in Baku. Uh, the theme we propose is uh, global challenges and opportunities or give the space a chance. This theme is very much multifaceted at its heart. Firstly, it's uh, very much relevant to Azerbaijan, which is an emerging space nation. And secondly, it is a topical urge for many emerging nations in Eurasian region, uh, which are not yet members of International Astronautical Federation, but very much keen to be a part of global space community. And finally, it is of universal importance as we strongly believe that space is the next level in evolution process of humankind. As a matter of fact, Baku uh, hosted a 24th International Astronautical Congress back in 1973 in Baku. Uh, this Congress at the time laid the foundation of Azerbaijan space sector and that's why it's very much dear to the hearts of our people and especially the ones who are working in the space industry. As we are bidding to host uh, the 73rd International Astronautical Congress in Baku, we are looking forward to welcoming back after almost 50 years a global space community in Baku. And I can assure you that the city is very much ready and fully ready to uh, give an exceptional congressional experience to our guests. Uh, I, I would like probably stop it here and uh, uh, invite you to view a very short video about our organization and our activities over the last seven years. Please, the video. Azerbaijan. We are Azer Cosmos, premier satellite services operator in the South Caucasus. As of February 2013, we have played a role as an important gateway in a joint space that connects more than 50 countries in Europe, Africa, Central Asia, and the Middle East. In 2014, we took over the rights to operate and commercialize as a sky high-resolution optical Earth observation satellite and entered into the commercial business of Earth observation services. In 2018, we launched as a Space 2 telecommunications satellite that would enhance our coverage area and spectrum of services. Built for as a Cosmos by SSL, as a Space 2 is telecommunications satellite with 35 active transponder KU band payload. Its designed lifetime is more than 15 years. As a Space 2 will serve Europe, Central and South Asia, the Middle East and Sub-Saharan Africa with high power KU band from 45 degrees east. The new spacecraft is ideally designed for smaller antenna and has cross connectivity between East Africa, West Africa and Central Africa, Europe and Central Asia. 
We are agile and our activity is based on values such as integrity, customer satisfaction, professionalism, team spirit and sustainable growth. Technical excellence complemented by customized approach. And we understand that it's equally uh, important to present our country and our city. And if you don't mind, I would like to uh, invite my colleague and fellow from our tourism board, Sevda, to present in a very short uh, period of time the, our city and our country. Thank you. Thank you, Rashad. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's my great honor to represent the Pearl of the Caucasus, my native country, Azerbaijan, at this event tonight. A country that is supported by a rich history that dates back five millennia, and a composite culture that had evolved with the passing through of travelers along the Great Silk Road. Today, I invite you to all to take a one in another look at Azerbaijan, a country of many revelations. Over the last decade, the tourism industry of Azerbaijan has seen a significant growth, making a substantial contribution to the economy. We are currently on the cusp of tourism boom, as we welcomed a record number of inbound visitors, spending more than two billion US dollars in 2018, making us one of the fastest growing tourism destinations in the world. In support of this growth, the National Promotional Body of Azerbaijan, new established Azerbaijan Tourism Board, launched its marketing campaign, Take Another Look, as a part of our strategy to present a new portrait of our country. Azerbaijan is definitely an Eastern country, but with a Western outlook, with an exceptional combination of antiquity and novelty, with several sites of interest. As one of the safest cities in the region, the capital city of Azerbaijan is Baku and is very easily accessible with over 50 direct flights across Europe, the Middle East, and the United States. Our contemporary nation offers authentic on-site activities, world-class conference facilities, luxury hotels, and of course, state-of-the-art venues. Baku has an impressively wide selection of conference facilities, but the ones we are planning to host the Congress at are the city's most remarkable 21st century architectural masterpieces. The two world-class venues stand out among the rest, both for their futuristic design as well as their ability to accommodate sophisticated large-scale international events and conventions. The brand new purpose-built Baco Convention Center and its impressive open-plan space offers an obstacle views across Baco's greatest architectural masterpiece called the Gedar Alif Center, designed by the famous architect Zaha Hadid. Our distinguished guests will be enthralled by the harmonious link between the centers, exterior and interior, that aspires to remove any boundaries in the building's perception, as the place is meant to be open to anyone, irrespective to race, gender, and origin bringing people together only shared by united experiences and ideas. As the economy diversifies, the city is committed to host not only major sporting and cultural events such as Formula One Grand Prix Azerbaijan, European Olympic Games, Islamic Solidarity Games, UFA League Final, and many others, but also be an international hub for different conferences and congresses. Rashad and I may be the only two physically representing our charming country at this prestigious venue tonight. But 
We are strongly supported by our government, who is committed to enhancing the destinational value of Azerbaijan. We have proudly embarked on a journey to share the hidden gems of our country. So, please, let us show you the video which might inspire you to take another look at Azerbaijan. Please enjoy. Azerbaijan. Five very different artists take another look at the country in their own unique style. Everywhere you look in Azerbaijan, there's another amazing view, another great character. It just never stops. You have to take another look, and then another. Baku is a city of the most amazing contrasts. Ancient and modern, crazy and chill. I need three lives to take it all in, to take another look. But it's the people who make it all come alive. I look at these walls and I can see when they were brand new and the people who built them and what their lives were like and it feels just like yesterday. I can't keep up with Azerbaijan. It has so many challenges for me. Cliffs, desert, mud volcanoes, mountains, Caspian Sea. It just goes on and on. Azerbaijan is a country that excites all senses. So many textures, tastes, sounds, scents. There's so much to explore to take another look. Take another look. Dear ladies and gentlemen, with that in mind, Baku is fully equipped and willing to host the International Astronautical Congress in 2022. Azerbaijan may not be a large country, but is the one with great ambition, diverse culture, and world-class infrastructure. So please, we have actually to show you everything that Baku and Azerbaijan is ready to offer. So please, accept our invitation to take another look and allow us to reveal our secrets and pleasantly surprise you with all that Azerbaijan, our native country and its beautiful capital has to offer. Thank you, and we will be expecting all of you in Baku in 2022. Thank you. Thank you very much. I think you got all some appetite now on, on, on some food. Um, but before closing this uh, GNF session, I would like to once again thank all the speakers and all, uh, all of you uh, to be with us tonight. And now uh, we are happy to invite you all for our traditional IEF cocktail upstairs, which uh, um, has been gratefully uh, sponsored also by Asa Cosmos. Thank you very much for being with us and see you upstairs. Enjoy the networking and enjoy a nice evening. Thank you.